Now we're gonna show a series from uh, getting smashed in half guard to get butterfly half and then some sweeping and attacks from there. So we're just in basic half. Ryan Jake's on top smashing and I'm blocking the cross face. I don't really have a guard, maybe I'm just tight. Okay, and Jake's on top smashing. I mean, I don't have an option for an underhook. Okay, so I'm gonna step, scoot my butt out this way, not up, I'm gonna scoot up. He just chases me and keeps smashing me, okay? So let's scoot out, step on the floor, scoot out, foot in, right, some butterfly, and Jake keeps smashing. So I release my guard. I'm gonna use my foot on the floor to turn my hip. I'm gonna walk him up on my knee, and I still have the butterfly hook, and we'll show another angle. So first option, you get to hear if reaping's allowed. You're gonna elevate his neck and his armpit away from you, scoot out, just create your angle, and attack. If reaping's not allowed, you just stop on his hip, and jack him up and just extend away and sweep, okay? So we're gonna work from there. So we're getting smashed again, keeping the cross face off, step, hip out, butterfly hook in, right? Release your guard, bring him to you, right? So we're gonna assume this time, I go to extend away and he retreats back. So I'm just gonna, almost like a technical stand, I'm gonna push him away, right, I'm gonna sit up, and it's kind of a new school butterfly. I'm posted on his shoulder to keep him from like, smashing in, and I'm kind of away. I'm not playing like old school butterfly, right? It's kind of a new school, one foot in, leg down. I mean, nothing new school, but we're here. Okay, Jake's gonna shoot an underhook. He's gonna try to you know, just wrestle me back down with his underhook and just do what people do. So we're gonna take a chance to get an overhook. And the thing is, here in this position, you don't wanna pulse in your hand, because the moment I get heavy, he grabs my wrist, runs me over. And not that I can't attack, but then I'm on my back again, okay? So once you get to the overhook, you scoot out and you get your forehead in his ear, or if his head is up here, you just kind of pull it down. All your weight needs to be in your knee and in your foot and on his knee. Okay, so we're here battling, right? I'm trying to get here or I'm here. I'm looking for his wrist. Okay, if you can't find it, you throw his head to the floor, you put his hand down and post, it'll be there. So the first one is gonna go two on one, like a baseball bat grip, right? Just holding tight, we're gonna fall. So raise up for a second. When I fall, I'm not gonna lift with my foot. It's not good enough. Your bottom leg is on your toes and you're just gonna press. You're gonna keep everything here and just press on your bottom foot, okay? So we're here, we find his wrist, basal back here, we fall straight to our side, we press on our foot, raise up. Stay connected the whole time. And the way you land, it'll be different every time depending on his reaction, okay? Next one. So again, a smash. All right, step, out, butterfly. I release and I get him to here. And again, I want to push away to go to single leg X or to reap for the finish, but he retreats. So I just follow him up, right? Same thing, we're back here. Okay, so here's the next one. He shoots the underhook to wrestle me. I post, scoot away. I'm looking for his wrist again, right? And if he's not there, again, throw him to the floor. He'll post for you. I'm going to gather. And when I go to hook sweep, right when I go, he posts his hand. So I'm going to post mine, shoot back, and just jump your triangle, okay? Last one for here. Same idea. When I go this time, right when I get to here, he made, he either forced me to put my weight in my hand or he just tried to run me over, right? He drives under, so I lay down, still have butterfly. I chest away, two hands come into the ear, leg over the back and I turn, right? Both knees, it's gonna swing, triangle, you know, sit up, omoplata, work your attack. Okay, last one, a little uh, heel hook series. We'll go from the beginning, one more time. He's smashing me, can't get an underhook. So I step out, Butterfly, release, and I jack him up on my knee. He retreats instead of getting the single leg X. Okay, and then uh, walk around this way. So, so there's three styles of butterfly for leg locks usually. There's probably more, but there's like old school, and then here, and then the last one is kind of like even like uh, just recently, like Craig Jones and like all, like all these leg lock guys do it where you hook the knee. Right, so we're isolating here. So all we're doing, same idea, I can get an underhook, with my forehead under his chin, and I'm reaching for the far arm, or if he has the underhook, I'm reaching for the far arm again. Okay, but I'm trapping, just both are just pinching together. Okay, whether I have the under or the over, it's not super important right here. Okay, I was gonna work from the over, because most people will pummel. And if they don't, it's easier anyways. So here, I'm gonna post away, and just for this one, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press my leg, goes from this side to the far side. I push him away, and I back step knee to knee, we're like, Parallel, right? And I'm holding the lax. I want to keep his weight in his hand or on his head. Right? I don't want his both like up here floating because he'll just start wrestling me. So when I back step on him, hooking the leg, I'm keeping everything attached. When I go, I'm pulling him, right? And I'm just parallel and I'm really heavy with him. 
I go between my leg and his, and I grab his hamstring, right? So I'm just here between his hamstring and the tuck, and roll. In the roll, you're gonna triangle, release your hand, and climb for the finish. Most of the time, you'll wanna gather the leg, right, and go through your series, but when you roll, a lot of times they're already working to pummel out, right? So you just turn away, hip escape, and go for your favorite finish, whether it's heel look, turn for the knee bar, whatever you like to do. So one more time, same thing, real quick. So you flatten me out, all right? All the same movements we just did. He retreats for me, right? To avoid it, so I sit in and around, right? He pummels under. Actually, this time I'll go. I'll go under and I'll go for all that. My head's under his chin, right? And one movement, some pinching. One movement. Step. Pull his weight on top. Dive under. Roll. Triangle on the way through. You're just climbing, climbing, climbing. Finding your attack.